welcome back everyone. Um, yeah, that last video was um, edited and produced pretty quickly and uh, didn't turn out exactly how I wanted at all, but it's leading into this one. Uh, I'm going to be talking about coasting and regen uphill and downhill and to know exactly how this Kona Electric works and whether it's better in coasting or regen in those various conditions, up or down. That's the idea. Uh, but before I do that, I'm just going to pick my daughter up. Um, so I thought I would film this while driving through the centre of Norwich. And as you can see right in front of us, it's Norwich Cathedral. It's a beautiful city, this. Um, I shouldn't really advertise Norwich, it's not what this is about. But uh, if you're in the UK or you're visiting the UK, come and see Norwich. It's uh, better than Cambridge. Cambridge seems to have the name, like the brand appeal, um, everyone wants to go there, but it's smaller, it's not as nice, Norwich has more shops, it's just a nicer environment and the people here are really really friendly. Anyway there you go, there's my Norwich and Norfolk advert for the day. Today I want to talk about coasting and regen, that's what we're going to be doing. So I've just reset the trip meter, I'll do the same each time just before that junction and we'll see what we're doing. We're in uh, regen level 2, going up the hill, so that's the first test. And I'll leave the video on so you can see what sort of hill I'm testing this on. Okay, so we've got to the car park and it's 0.9 of a mile, so I got it wrong, it's not 2 miles, it's 1, and it's 3.1 miles per kilowatt hour. So let's go down the hill now and see what result we get going down in the same regen level. junction that's 8.8 .8 miles per kilowatt hour oh sorry 15.5 miles per kilowatt hour and uh, annoyingly at the roundabout it's now gone up to 41.5 miles per kilowatt hour so here we go let's go back up the hill switch it into regen zero so it's coasting mode and reset from here, the same junction. I'll try and do exactly the same speed, and we'll see now if in Regen Zero coasting whether we get similar results. Three point one, <laughs> exactly the same. So, coasting uphill or regen two uphill made no difference at all. Okay, so we're still in coasting mode. I'm now going to reset the trip meter, and it's downhill now in coasting, so no regen. Which I guess I'm just going to have the foot th off the throttle and the brake, and it's going to accelerate. So I'll have to occasionally use the brake. We're at the speed limit already. Uh, well, it's already at 8 miles per kilowatt hour, and uh, it was about here at the junction, it was 8.8, .8, and it's going to be 10.6. So, coming downhill in coasting um, was better for me than uh, regen. Not what I expected. So yeah, marginally different, but it might be marginally different on, you know, 10, 20 metres more of downhill well, than that regen. So, yeah. it was so marginal, I would basically say it was pretty much the same result. So I'm going to worry less about it in future and not worry whether I'm in coasting mode or regen and go with what feels most comfortable. As always, thanks for watching, take care and I'll see you again soon. 
Bye-bye.